back to day two of Tommy's of Christmas. Um, if you guys are new to my channel, hi, my name is Eileen. And if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit that red button down below. Um, so for today, as you guys can tell by the title, I'm going to be sharing you guys Christmas movies um, from Netflix. Um, if you guys are looking for what to see through the holidays with your fa family or by yourself, it's all good. I watch them by myself, most of them. Um, so I just want to share with you guys what I have seen and kind of a little background what they are if you guys are interested and also um, if they have new ones because I know they're coming out with some new ones. Um, so I'm going to be sharing maybe between 5 to 10 or maybe 15, depending what I see, um, uh, Christmas movies, specifically Christmas. Um, so if you guys are interested in knowing which ones I have seen and which ones I plan on seeing in the next couple weeks, then keep on watching. Alright guys, so the first movie um, that I'm going to share with you guys, it's, it's like three movies in one, I guess. Or the same like, uh, the same people that come out in the same movies. Um, the first movie is going to be uh, Christmas Prince, and I'm going to put a picture right here, right here. Um, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about. Um, like I said, these are on Netflix, so if you guys don't have Netflix, maybe ask for someone. Maybe I can let you borrow your Netflix. They're a Netflix account. But, um, A Christmas Prince, um, one of maybe my favorite movies. Um, they do have like two other consecutive ones. And it's basically, you know, typical ordinary girl falls in love with the prince. The whole works, right? Um, a bit cheesy, but hey, it's all good. Um, so those, I would consider that one as one movie, but they are three consecutive ones, um, so you can definitely see them like back to back. Um, another movie, I guess similar to that one, would be, let's see, I've seen similar ones but I've not really liked them, they're like way too cheesy or like too like fairy tale, and sometimes you know, you kind of need a bit of reality. Um, I have watched A Bad Mom's Christmas and I really enjoy it, it was really funny, uh, it was more realistic, um, language is a bit too, um, you know, they say bad words and stuff like that, um, but I mean, I think it's okay, I don't know, my personal opinion, um, but it was really funny, um, I watched that one by myself, but I had a lot of fun with it, um, so you guys are looking for something more like fun and bad mom vibes <laughs> you guys can go ahead and check that one out another movie i really enjoyed watching was holiday rush um this movie really brings that awareness of what you have and um really enjoying your family enjoying the present and what matters is family at the end of the day right if you guys are interested that one i really enjoyed that one it was really really nice um there's 48 christmas wishes i haven't watched that one but it really it looks interesting um, so I might be watching that one also. The Night Before Christmas. That one I think I watched it last year. I haven't watched it this year because I've already watched it. But uh, from what I can remember, it was a it was, it was a good one. Um, Vanessa Hudgens comes out on it. So I mean, if you guys like her her how her acting, you guys can go ahead and watch that one. Another one that she comes out in is The Princess Switch. And they recently came out with the second one this year, and I watched them both <laughs> again. Um, it's it is kind of cheesy, uh, but I guess fun, and it has a little bit of everything. Um, so that one's pretty good, I guess. Ooh, a holiday! This movie was really really fun to watch, and if you guys are interested in having or watching fun and entertaining, more than cheesy Christmas vibes, then holiday I think would be a good fit. Um, I really enjoy that one. I personally don't watch like Elf and Christmas Chronicles and like The Grinch. Um, I have watched them before but they just don't get my attention. Another Christmas movie Netflix has is Christmas in the Heartland. Um, it's about two girls, they go back to their um, families or grandparents that they don't really grew up with. Um, and these two girls meet on the plane and they kind of do a switch. Um, it was kind of fun to watch. Um, so I think that switch kind of 
made the whole movie more exciting, I wanna say. Um, so you guys can watch maybe that one. There's another one that I'm trying to look, I don't recall the name. Okay, Christmas Catch. That was that one was pretty pretty cool. Um it's about like police, FBI, I don't know if FBI or police. Um they're trying to catch this person and they kind of make the, the girl go on dates with the person that they're trying to catch and stuff like that. Um, but, you know, they end up falling in love and the whole works. That one was pretty pretty. Um, that one was good, I want to say. Holiday in the Wild. Um, that one was pretty um, cool. I mean, I keep saying they are pretty cool and cute and cheesy and whatever, but I mean, that's kind of the whole point of Christmas, right? So, Holiday in the Wild, that was really good. Um, there are definitely other movies here, you, you know, that I haven't watched. I have mentioned some that I have watched and some that I haven't. So, um, if you know, if you guys are interested, I'm going to put them all down below, the ones that I have mentioned. And also the ones that I plan on watching. Um, so you guys know you can watch them and if you guys have or haven't and, or if you guys do watch them you guys can also let me know what you guys thought of them in the comments down below um so this is gonna be the wrap for day two of 12 days of christmas i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope um you guys you know catch some popcorn lay in your bed and watch the movies take a break one or two times a day and i hope to see you guys on my next uh, video which will be tomorrow so don't miss out um don't forget to comment share like and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to turn on your post notifications so you guys can get notified tomorrow when i post day three of two days of christmas all right guys merry christmas um enjoy your family your holidays and i'll see you guys on my next video Bye.